Well, Callum, first of all, welcome to the club. How are you enjoying life as a, as a Stockport County player? Yeah, I feel like I've settled in well. It was good to get the first game, obviously, out of the way against Bradford, which was a good win for everyone. But uh, yeah, I've been here probably over, just over a couple of weeks now. I was training a bit before I signed. And then it's been good now to get involved with a couple of with the games. Yeah, we'll get on to that, that debut in just a minute. But tell us a little bit more about how the moves come about, what the last few few months have been like for you. Yeah, it's been a different few months from what I'm normally used to. I was obviously at Tranmere last year. Um, and then we had good dialogue with the club and we was things looked like they were going to go I was going to go up to a couple of clubs up the levels and then as it didn't happen then teams have their squads built obviously and it became a bit of a challenging few months but it was about staying fit and then Stockport came about and it was an opportunity I was really excited about and a club which is going in one direction and I think you only have to come here for a day and you see the setup and you see the staff and the players and the quality around the building and it's somewhere which you really want to be at the moment. And as far as debuts go, playing in front of 18,000 at Bradford, tell us what, what that was like for you. Yeah, thrown straight in the deep end, wasn't it, pretty much? But I think it's the best way to go about it. Um, just go straight in and give it everything. And it, to be, I think it held up pretty well in the end. And to come away with that, with, with three points, with a clean sheet, what has that done for, for the confidence around this place? Yeah, speaking to the boys, they said that performance-wise, it's not been far off it. They're just fine margins, especially at this level, is can be a set piece here or there or something and it could have been a very different start to the season but we're behind on points from what we want to be but that win could kick us on a little bit of a run now which I think what everyone's thinking about. And, and you've been part of a, a successful side in this division, got to the playoffs a couple of years ago with Tranmere, just missed out last year. I mean when you look around you, what, what do you think this, this team, this group of players is, is capable of? Going all the way, I think when you come in the technical standard of training is very high and it was before coming on the outside and then only seeing training, it was difficult to work out why the team hadn't picked up so many points. But that's how it's been before I was here. I didn't really, I didn't see all of the games, so I don't know how they've all gone. But from here and around, this team will go up the league pretty quickly, I'm sure. And on a personal note, you've obviously signed an initial deal until January. What are you hoping to achieve between now and then? What are your aims? My aim is just to get my head down, play as many games as I possibly can, help this club move up the league and then... I will speak to the staff here and I'll see what sort of situation, what we lie in in January and hopefully something could get sorted and we'll see what, where we can go forward from there. Well, you certainly left a, a good impression on the county fans in that game on Saturday. What were your first impressions of them as well, playing in front of 2,000 fans <laughs> almost in that away end? Yeah, for a, a League 2, well, it's a bigger than a League 2 club, but for a club which is playing in League 2, to have that following and that backing is massive for, for us as players. It, you, you walk out and the noise they made throughout the whole game was incredible and and then obviously this Saturday at home, you're hearing there's already over 8,000 people turning up and it's such a well-supported club and it really gives you a massive lift. A tough test, obviously, this weekend against Grimsby, but uh, I guess last week has shown that this team's more than a match for, for any side in this league. Yeah, I think Bradford are on a crazy run at home of not losing a game in so long. So there's no one to fear at all in this league and the same with Grimsby, we'll go and play our own game against them. Impose, especially at home, we'll impose how we want to play and hopefully that'll lead us on the right side of the result. And just finally, a first experience of, of playing at Edgeley Park for you. How much are you looking forward to that? Yeah, I am. I'm, the atmosphere is well known that it's going to be good there. and I'm looking forward, tomorrow we're, um, we're training down there, so I'm looking forward to getting down, getting my, getting my bearings, seeing the surroundings and hopefully can't wait to be on the pitch. Callum, thanks for speaking to us. Perfect, nice one.